Hello Family Friday number 26 and this is the first of a four-parter in which we're going to make an optical dot punch. An optical dot punch, for those of you who aren't familiar, is a device which makes layup and marking out holes really accurate. You put in a little lens, you can line it up with a given mark and then at the, the right moment swap that lens over for a, a punch and give it a tap with a hammer to mark it out. So we're going to look at the design today and the particular design of the lens and in the next video it's going to be the manufacture of the body, then the punch, then finally the hardest bit, the lens itself. So there's not a lot to say about the main body, it's just basically uh, drawn up to make use of some two inch aluminium stock that we've got hold of. It is literally um, just effectively a top hat with two holes in it and um, some chamfers just to uh, avoid sharp edges. The punch itself is going to be made from silver steel and we're going to go through the hardening process of that. Um, so the silver steel is because it's got high dimensional accuracy so we've got a, um, a really tight sliding fit on the, on the main body and also it's going to harden up nicely for that end point. The final most complicated bit is the optical punch and this is something we're going to make from some 15mm acrylic rod which is on order which is why I can't put it in this particular video. And we've done a little bit of research as to why we've got this radius 23.26 and it's been quite interesting looked at some lens geometries and it turns out I'm no lens expert but there's a whole bunch of different um, lens shapes for different reasons this is a laser lens for focusing into a particular light form um, it turns out the PCX or the plano convex lens is perfect for um, focusing applications and also here it says focusing light which is exactly what we need so I found a 15mm lens checked out some of the specs here and our key um, key dimension is R1 and R1 is 23.6 so in our lens itself let's have a look at the sketch we've got the R23.6 and the uh, the 15mm exterior so when that comes into the revolution we should have our lens and we're going to look in the third video or the fourth video rather about flame polishing the ends to get that fine optical finish so by the time you watch this we should already have the second video out in which we make the aluminium body i'm not going to do anything particularly fancy for this I'm going to make it all on a manual machine get some of those manual skills back up and going after a lot of cnc videos so if you like this video do subscribe like and comment and i'm going to put a link for the PDF versions of the drawing in the comments section so that you can uh, download and make this project at home. But before you go, I'll just leave you with a bit more footage of the punch itself and also the three working drawings so you can have a look at it, get an idea of the size of the material you'll need. For the body itself, it's gonna be some uh, two inch diameter aluminum stock. Um, for the punch, it's a 12 millimeter uh, silver steel section. And for the acrylic, we're going to go with, uh, well, 15mm acrylic rod. So that should give you some chance to gather materials ready for the, the main manufacture of the product. Thank you.